and gentlemen, please be seated. So ladies and gentlemen, this time what I'm going to ask you to do is please go ahead and silence your cell phones. That'll be our first thing. Friends, we're here to celebrate with Charlene and Tony, the beginning of their journey together as husband and wife. In truth, this is not a new journey, but a continuation of a journey begun many months ago. A journey that commenced with an introduction, a casual conversation, a first date, and grew from there into a friendship, a deep caring and love a desire to share life with each other. Therefore, Charlene and Tony stand before you today to declare that even though they know the love that they have found profoundly, two additional elements are needed within it, and that's the need for commitment to be made here today. Therefore, those two elements are the blessing of God and the support of you as their family and friends. By holding this service a commitment in a place associated with the gathering of people of faith, Charlene and Tony want to acknowledge your dependence upon God and their conscious and deliberate invitation for God to be an integral part of this marriage. Therefore, they humbly ask God to bestow blessings upon this service, upon their vows, and upon their journey as a husband and wife. Therefore, Charlene and Tony also ask you as their family and friends to pray for them often, because each of you has contributed to this relationship through your encouragement, advice, and also your friendship. And even though Charlene and Tony will relate to you differently than before, they want you to know that your love, support, and encouragement are still needed. Also, Charlene and Tony want to acknowledge your parents on this occasion. Today, they offer profound gratitude to you as parents for all love and care that you showed them as you were raising them. Their gifts of love, gifts of love and support have inspired them to become who they are today. Parents, I want you to know one thing. These kids love you. They care about you. And they truly appreciate all the things that you've done for them. I think the parents deserve a hand, so let's give them one. Therefore, Charlene and Tony, here in the presence of God and these people, I ask you to declare your intention to enter into a holy covenant through the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ. Charlene, will you have Tony to be your husband, to live together in holy marriage? Will you love him, comfort him, honor and keep him in sickness and in health, forsaking all this as long as you both shall live? If so respond with, I will. Very well. Tony, I also ask you, will you have Charlene to be your wife, to live together in holy marriage? Will you love her? Comfort her, honor and keep her in sickness and in health, forsaking all this as long as you both shall live. If so, respond with, I will. I will. Very well. Uh, Acknowledging God brought together this couple today, who is the honor of presenting this woman to this man? Uh, You're permitted. Uh, <laughs> no way to go, George. <laughs> with that being said, you may kiss the bride. No. <laughs> you can get the bride. Welcome on board. <laughs> and I'm going to ask for my first reader to come, please. is one in which your love for each other exceeds your need for each other. So love yourselves and love one another. Love all that is your life together and all else will follow. Thank you, Abraham, folks. And now my second reader come, please. 
Brian. Brian.